Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to C2L. I am Tommy Day. I'm Kalpa. Welcome to Chennai to Lagos. What's Today up? we are doing Show Me a Photo Off Challenge. We've seen a couple of challenges going around, so we decided to do our own. So we asked some of you um, what you wanted to see on our Instagram. And so let's get right to it. Let's get right to it. So a lot of you asked us for our childhood pictures. A um, bunch of you asked us for that. So uh, this is Tom's. This is me right over here, a very handsome young boy. <laughs> a lot of people don't believe this is me, but this was me. <laughs> this was uh, International Montessori 1996. Yeah, I don't know if I gave away my age through this, but <laughs> yeah. Well, I and I'm think everybody knows. And I'm showing you guys my favorite picture. I want to do something with this. But yeah, this is me. What You're a pretty cute. young boy. You're cute. Tell them the story of how your cuteness hindered your success. Oh yeah, that's a very good story. So when I was a kid, everyone used to stop and be like, oh my God, you're so cute, you're so cute, you're so cute. I didn't know how to handle that at the time. Um, so I remember there was a time in, uh, was it Rusinga, class one, I was running. And by the way, for those of you who know me, or at least probably knew me back then, running was one of my things. So I'm here running and all these like older girls are like, oh my God, that's a kid, he's so cute, he's so cute. And I guess the pressure got to me and I stopped running as fast as I was. Like I could feel their eyes. So I literally just gave up the race. I don't know why. If you're a psychologist, you could tell me what was going on in my life at the time, but I'm different now. So yeah, that's the cost of being cute. I think, I think you just cute. Got, like conscious. Yeah, I was just too much was attention, just, like, too much attention. <laughs> yeah, but anyway. You are in the spotlight. Yeah, and this is mine. This is one of my favorite childhood pictures. I have so many. I have this cute little one, uh, but this is my favorite one because I remember like, you know what I'm wearing? The black velvety thing was actually a, a gift my mom got me for Diwali. And it's so special because at this particular point in our lives, like, you know, getting something so new and so special was so rare. Uh, because we were all just, you know, my parents were really trying to find stability and, you know, moving around and all that. So I remember it was a really special time and my dad is actually not with us. He was in Kenya and we were in the then Bombay. Right now it's Mumbai, but we were living in Bombay. So um, this is the picture my mom took of me. She took me to a studio and, you know, I did some cute poses and I had this like Mickey Mouse glasses, which I loved. And she actually sent them like postcards to my dad in Kenya for, um, I think, as a gift for him, I guess. So it's really cute and it's really nice that I still have such pictures with me. Yeah, so if people who are wondering what our kids would look like, just fuse those two childhood pictures and imagine what that would look like. <laughs> yeah. Okay, one of you asked us uh, for a picture of having a weird expression. Um, That's a good one. We have so many pictures, but this one was like the weirdest, weird expression. And it's a series of pictures. It's like 20, 25 pictures of just doing weird expression. Your favorite thing in your house? This is a very good one. We have a pillar in the house. Um, it's like an indent within the pillar. And then there's that light. Has a light. Exactly. You can keep something there or whatever. Exactly. So it's very aesthetic. It looks really nice. And you know, at night, like when you put the light on, it just has this really cool vibe. So that's it. Of everything. That's, that's like our thing. most favorite thing. That's like, <laughs> that's the only reason we got the house. You know? <laughs> we yeah. About. Um, something beautiful in your neighborhood. Well, we live near the beach, so that's that. Always winning. Yeah. Can't always, beat the beach. Always the winner feature is. Can't beat the beach. The beach. Yes. Yeah. Um, your first selfie. Yep. So this is it. This is actually one of the first events we did after we we won the title of Mr. and Ms. And we weren't dating at this point. Not actually. at all. We were just like workmates. Funny thing about this day, when my this was actually the first time my mom saw Kalba like outside. Well, she'd seen she me had on seen you on that stage, yeah. yeah. But like now, obviously that time she was not like I don't even think she noticed me because exactly. we were so many on the stage. But then on this date, I don't know, my mom was like so much like, wait, is that Miss USIU? Are you? She's so beautiful. Aww. Yeah. My mom is really sweet. Yeah. She's beautiful too. Yeah, very beautiful. <laughs> Your honeymoon. 
This is interesting. We we actually didn't post any of our pictures from our honeymoon. Yeah. Neither did we make a video from it, and it was quite intentional. We just didn't want to. We wanted to be in the moment, um, even though we actually did, we did a few clips. Yeah, we didn't take a for few YouTube, minutes, yeah. but we never actually you know acted on it. Um, yeah. But here is like you know it, it, this is probably like one of our best pictures. This is like the most. Honeymoon, honeymoon picture. looking picture. Yeah, this hotel so, had like the most beautiful robes, like cotton yeah, robes, so, and it was so cozy. Yeah, it's a honeymoon, y'all. Not I'm talking about. So, <laughs> hey. Um, your first photo together. First photo together. I hate this picture. <laughs> Me too. I, I hate, hate it. I, so you know, because of this challenge, we had to go back to get so many pictures, and all of them were so cringy. Like you're like, oh, why? And so this is like. This Yuck. picture, I hate it. The lighting is horrible. Yuck. <laughs> why do I look like a, a... Why do I look like... Okay, just context. Anyway, luckily, these are the guys. No one will know who they are. But it was a... Uh, it was a... Uh, what kind of challenge was it? We were meant to I dress think it was alike? To, yeah, we were supposed to match uh, with your partner. It was just one of the challenges for Miss Tennis. And I feel like Tom and I just didn't think creative. I don't know why we went to... I don't know where... I think we... I. Who knows how we got here? But even look, like my collar was up. It was oh, like yuck. I I put together this like suit looking thing like the evening before. Clearly, it was intentional. And it was horrible. It Gosh. was horrible. I don't know where I got this yellow scarf thing. I don't know from. how we won. <laughs> and my hairstyle and like my oily face. Like yeah. I don't know who was happening. I don't know how we won. I know the worst part is we're standing <laughs> next to the couple that actually won that challenge. Yeah, but they did like the lock and pop thing, and they looked so cute together. So and they did like the cute like move as well. And then there was us. We were just we were looking like flight attendants. <laughs> Let's just wear black and yellow. <laughs> That's the best we could come up with. Mm, black and yellow. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> let's let's move on. To the next I hate it so much. Next. I hate uh, view from your house. View from our house. So um, yeah. Does that picture? The the most beautiful part is that we have like these amazing plants and this very cute tree. Those, those yeah. are my favorite things about our entrance. Your wallpaper. Yeah. Um. So mine. I'll screenshot it right now. A. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's my favorite picture from the wedding, actually. I have not updated my wallpaper. It's been that. I've had that picture for such a long time. One of my favorite pictures of her. And uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that. Um, of you as students. Hmm. Mm. So this is actually. I know this looks like a cropped up picture because it is. <laughs> There's another person in the picture, and I was so directly looking for a, a uniformed picture, you know. Picture. Uh, but this is me in IB, uh, IB one, I think. And yeah, like if you guys, anyone from St Mary's. Hello, this That's is from Saints. One. I had just become head girl at this point, I guess. Yeah. This this oh. was this was me in my graduation. That's it's the closest. One of those pictures that's like blurry. Yeah. Oh god. <laughs> from back in the day. <laughs> look at this. Oh, I don't know how I feel cute. when I look at these pictures. I You know sometimes yeah. I wonder like when I see pictures of you like this and then when I see pictures of me like looking like, you know, a newborn chicken. Um, what? <laughs> how would you say like, that? Like, do you think we'd have found each other attractive <laughs> pre-adolescent No, but things. come on. At this time, I've, I'm sure I felt like I was making a nice pose. I put this picture up on my Facebook. I feel if I did that, this must have been the best picture I had. I probably was confident in this. I loved how I looked. I loved my face. I loved... Yeah, so, hey... If we met at this time, I think we probably would have confidence. Would, would have been would feeling have ourselves. I don't know if we would have been feeling <laughs> each other. We would have been feeling ourselves. Uh, that's crazy. Of you as Mr. and Miss at uni, we have so many pictures of us as Mr. These are pictures and Miss. we never lack. Yeah. This is when we actually started taking pictures. Yeah, this is when we knew the value of taking pictures. Yeah, this is like the most official Mr. and Miss picture that was even put in the newspaper. Yeah. Um, and like the whole the gazette thing. So, and mm. it happens to be one of my favorite too. Yep. That's that says Mr. and Miss. Of you guys working. Hmm. 
I don't even know what we were doing here, but it was the most perfect picture to find for this. Yeah. Like a whole bunch of papers and yeah. My yeah. face says I'm really not it working. So cute, but yeah. I had just got my hair and I really like that hairstyle. I like it. FYI. I look yeah. too serious though. Yeah, you look like you are working in the government and some very important <laughs> papers have come and I look like <laughs> like the intern. <laughs> That's a nice one. Yeah. With the braid. Obviously this applies to me. Yeah. Do you ever have a braid at any point? I, I can. <laughs> I can do it. Um actually I did braids like I think a year or two ago. Um yeah, you did two. Yes, and I, I've always sort of had like, you know, moments where I've done braids. When I was in school and then when I was in uni. And so at this point, I think I was actually at work and yeah, yeah. Where? Oh yeah, this was. This was actually our uh, uni MBA. Yeah, this was an MBA yeah. class. Mm. Yeah, but it was one of my favorite braids that was done. And then go to the other one. It I took like, literally this one. Look at how cute she looks. It took like almost a whole day. Like you know, my hair is really long, so doing the whole thing it took almost a whole day. And the saddest thing is I removed it in like a week. <laughs> wow. Because it was so hard to maintain the, you know, the hair. Doesn't she look so cute? Yo, like and comment if you want her to do braids again. Okay. I think we should we'll make see. that happen. We'll Third see. Third time's a charm. <laughs> Where he first asked you out. Um, this is actually not in my hostel in 2016. No, I think it was. It was probably, okay, I don't know. Was it 2016? Yeah. Okay, yeah. End of 2016. We don't have a picture of, you know... No, what I'm saying is that the picture was not from 2016. Yeah, but like... Later. But yeah, know. that is the area. Um, as we said, we didn't take a lot of pictures funny enough back yeah, then. Yeah, I don't know um, why. But yeah, now we, we, we will never miss out on pictures like this going forward. So. Yeah, but like uh, it was actually my hostel room and there was just like one mirror. Um, that was in the room and like we yeah I think that was where that was probably the first picture we took in that hostel room at some point I don't know when yeah but we look really young so it must have been like years ago <laughs> um, most memorable day of you two um, so which one is yours there are two okay I think let to be fair let's say accept the wedding okay I think the most memorable day will still go back to that picture of Mr. and Miss, we can show a different one of me celebrating. Yeah, that's it right there. So that was me celebrating when she was called because I was called first to be Mr. And as you guys know, she was my partner. So hearing them call her, I was just on top of the world. So yeah, that's a very, very memorable day because that was literally the beginning of all these things happening. As partners, yeah, we were friends, but now we had to actually become closer because we have the title together so um yeah that's it yeah but for me like the winner is of course our wedding day of course yeah but you know you have to also value where you came from so the mr and this one was also very special yeah started from <coughs> now we're here yeah first date Again, we, say we don't have pictures. We don't have pictures. It's, it's like know. we were living in the 80s or something. Because yeah. we don't have pictures of anything. And that's just that. honestly like the vibe that we. But obviously now we know better. But this was. Yeah, one this of comes the early to dates. our first date. Yeah. Um, I think it was like not that far from the actual date that you took me on. This was a really beautiful one. Yeah, this is actually an event yeah. that you performed in. I no, 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 I didn't perform. But people thought I owned the venue. Nice, yeah. nice, nice story. Nice story. So everyone, yeah. I don't know, was coming to talk to him. They were like, can, can we enter this place? I'm like, yeah, sure. They thought I owned the place, man. Mm -hmm. But it was a really nice day. I loved, I loved this picture. It was yeah. like one of the first pictures we actually put out that kind of let people know that oh y'all are y'all are y'all are that now yeah yeah it's like the first official so it's a picture it's very important picture um that was where i put the first my first time using the hashtag wce woman crush every day <laughs> that's where people know it's real so that's a special uh, i've not done a post like that in a while i should okay a hairstyle you regret um so personally like you know i've always had like 
pretty much the same hair and I've never done I've never dared to do something so different which would help me regret but I don't have it but this comes closest I think this is like a post nap look or something because what was happening I look like I have valleys and mountains in my hair it's like you just packed all your hair back yeah but why does it look like that and why didn't I correct it but I think I think you know it's one of those naps that changes your world like it just moves you I think it was a nap like that because I'm also looking at my eyes and they look red and bulged <laughs> to be honest you don't even look tired to me because I'm from napping so <laughs> you know I just look that like those babies sense. that just naps <laughs> I think this is like I, the, the, what I regret is that we actually took a picture of this moment yeah. for some reason what I regret even more for you is that you're showing us to the world but hey you know I look cute all the time she does I look cute all the time also, still, you, you guys still look one. cute there yeah yeah I mean that look is like me knowing I look cute <laughs> uh, what do you have one uh, I honestly really don't have except right now you see let me explain to you guys I'm I'm trying to I'm having barber issues yeah don't don't be I'm looking don't for a new barber right so right now we're having we're, we're working on it we have we're looking for a new barber to come and you know grace my head so i could help but no, you don't trust no, me thank you that would make i've a, taken care of this hair of mine it's for not years. the same thing i agree it's yeah. totally not the same thing but i value your hair like i value my yeah hair. so guys pray for me i need to find my a new barber and i, I miss my barber and i will be george i miss you i really <laughs> miss you <laughs> george we dedicate this video to you i miss you george <laughs> <sighs> yeah. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. Um, this was quite fun. I think we should do this again. Yes. Um, yeah, let's look for more pictures. And you guys can send us more questions when that time comes. But yeah, this was fun. It's nice to kind of go back in time, look at how funny we looked. At least I know. You look cute, you know. But yeah, this was really, this was really fun. This is really, really fun. I think we should do something in the future where we look at like childhood pictures and compare different ages. Yeah, we should. Yeah. We'll do like a timeline time comparison. Thing. Yeah. That'll be fun. Yes, but thank you for watching. Thank you. Um, thank you for watching our very cringy pictures. But yes, let's uh, let's see in the next video. Like, subscribe, share with a friend, and uh, be back soon. God bless. Bye. Bye. -bye.